face in your in your in your face. What's up, YouTube? Dubstep Slot 415 back again with another Sneakerhead Saturday. Let's go ahead and get straight into the pickups. As you guys can see, the first items up today are socks. I got six pairs of Jordan socks from East Bay and four pairs of LeBron Elites. So two pairs of white and gray elephant print, royal and navy, and then gray and charcoal. They all have elephant print on the top half of the sock. I did cop the four LeBron Elites, red and white, gray and green. Same uh, kind of like light blue and navy as the Jordan socks. And then the black and red. I did cop a few things from beyondhype.com. We got the infrared 2 Rostoclop bracelet right here. Next up, we got the well armored lanyard. This doubles as a lanyard as well as a bottle opener right here. They've got uh, two prints, an elephant print and a uh, gray and black speckling. It's a well-armed sticker. For 20% off at Beyond Hype, enter the code YouTube and follow them on Instagram at beyond underscore hype. I got to give a big shout out to my homie Stacy over at Stacks and Kicks, stacksandkicks.com. Sent me out a couple tees but he also sent me out some accessories. First off, he included these very cool Stacks and Kicks patches. Definitely be putting one of these on my backpack. Got your Stacks and Kicks info. At Stacks and Kicks on Twitter, Stacks and Kicks on IG. They also did make some uh, rubber bracelets. Got Stacks and Kicks. Breast Cancer Awareness, so shout out to you man, I believe the proceeds for these went to the uh, Breast Cancer Foundation. Also, they do include uh, details on how to take care of your tees. I think this is something a lot of companies should do that are doing tees with uh, like a heavy print. So the first tee he sent out was their Psycho Going Michael tee, got Michael in red with the black splatter. The rest of the tee is white. Get your Stacks and Kicks logo right there. The Stacks and Kicks SK on the back. I really appreciate Stacy looking out for my girl, sending out a size small in their Stacks and Kicks lace tee in pink and white. Stacks and Kicks. Once again, thank you to Stacy. Next up, we got a Nike T. It's actually released a few years ago. Got your diamond ring with the shine coming off of it in chrome. All black T. Still got the original Nike tag attached. 24 bucks. Before I get into today's pairs, I want to talk about the new giveaway with myself, Dubstep Slot 415 and fellow YouTuber Laidback365. I'm gonna go ahead and go over the requirements one more time about the giveaway. You must be subscribed to myself and Laidback365's YouTube channel. All of the information and links will be in the description. All comments related to the giveaway will be given the same answer. Check the description. So, you need to be subscribed to our YouTube channel. You need to follow us on Twitter. His Twitter is laidback365. Mine is dubstepslap415. You need to follow both of us on Instagram. I have the same, dubstepslap415 on Instagram. But laidback365, his Instagram screen name is Gunners International. And the fourth and final thing you need to do is like our Facebook pages. Mine, again, is Dubstep Slot 415. And his 
is Gunners International once again. And please check the description down below the video. All of the links will be there. You must confirm that you've done all four things if you are chosen as the winner. And if you are chosen as the winner and you have in fact not done all four requirements, I'm sorry, you do not qualify for the prize. To get into the details about the giveaway, this giveaway is going to happen through Instagram. So if you don't have an account, I strongly, strongly recommend making one and taking at least five sneaker related pictures. Accounts with under five sneaker pictures will not qualify for the giveaway. We want actual sneakerheads winning these prizes. So what you need to do is take creative pictures of your shoes. Each person is limited to two photos each. They can be on feet, shots of your collection, or just a way you've set up the shoes for a specific shot. But we do want thought and creativity behind the photos. You need to make sure and tag at Gunners International and at Dubstep Slap 415 in your picture along with the hashtag DC to the Bay. If you don't include the DC to the Bay hashtag, Laid Back and myself will have no way of seeing your picture. It won't stick around in our notification center long from everyone who will be entering. So the DC to the Bay hashtag is the main most important thing. For the people who like to know the dates and duration of the giveaway, once my video is live today, the giveaway will be happening and it will run through next Friday, November 16th. At that point, Laid Back and I will converse about whose photos are our favorite. And in my next Sneakerhead Saturday video on Saturday, November 17th, the three winners will be announced. For those who have just subscribed to Laid Back 365 or have been subscribed to him, Keep an eye out later this afternoon. He will be uploading a video regarding this giveaway as well. But hopefully we see some great pictures and we get a positive turnout. Good luck, everybody. Getting into the first couple pairs today. We've got a LeBron 8 box and a brown Nike box. Let's get into the Nike box first. Nike Air Penny 5, dark gray, court purple, black, and RV pink. If you know what the RV pink is, let me know. So these are the Phoenix Suns Penny 5s. I gotta say, I'm very pleased with this colorway. Definitely a scoop for me. I have the Air Force 180s and the Suns colorway on the way to me as well. First off, what jumps out is the midsole with that dope color fade. Purple Nike swoosh outlined in orange. Got your son's color penny logo. Part two, heaven sent. The other shoe says the storm is over. Got another penny logo right there, as well as on the tongue. Your insole, <clears throat> not sure if you're gonna be able to get a shot of it. But it does have the state of Tennessee with Penny 5 on it. And then the right shoes insole reads, Ballin' is what I was meant to do. Very pleased with this Suns colorway and the color blocking. So hopefully they uh, drop some more shoes in this colorway. Alright, moving on to the LeBron. LeBron 8 V1 box. But similar to the 10s I got a couple weeks ago. You see, no label. So I went ahead and opened up the box. As you guys can see, we got some LeBron 8 V1 breads. But this isn't just any normal pair. This is a promo sample pair. So the tag on the inside of the shoe reads promo Y3. I will give you guys a shot of the promo tag now. Main reason I cop these is because uh, I haven't had a uh, general sample 
of a LeBron shoe yet. And with how much I've been loving the 8s, 9s, and 10s, I definitely wanted to swoop it up. As you guys can see, really nice black suede on the toe, mid panel, and back heel. It's your black carbon fiber fly wire. Your red tongue. Got your lion with the red eyes. So nothing really different from the general release pair aside from the promo tag, but I am very grateful to have these. Shout out to the dude on Soul Collector who let him go crazy low. Moving on to the next two pairs. Got a Nike SB pink box and a new LeBron 10. This isn't any Nike SB pink box though. It's one of my serious grails. So if you've been following my channel for a while, you should have an idea of what they are. We'll get into those before the LeBron 10s. So Nike SB pink box. Nike Dunk Low Pro SB Aqua and Chrome. USB heads know what these are. Those who don't, these are the Nike SB Tiffany Dunks, a limited release in 2005, along with a few other shoes, made up the Nike SB Manager Series Pack. These are still 100% dead stock, never even laced up. Still got the extra Tiffany Blue laces attached. This makes my third pair. And please do not ask if you can buy one. They're not for sale. These are one of my top SB grails. Black rubber outsole. It's your white midsole with white stitching. You can see on the upper, got that faux kind of like alligator croc print going around the toe box, up the eyelets, and on your back heel chrome swoosh and then you've got your diamond Tiffany color on your toe box mid panel and the top of the back heel Nike on the back in silver on the tongue got the diamond supply company logo with Nike SB very very grateful I was able to find a third pair of these if you want to know the real meaning behind them, go watch my first video. I'm not going to explain it again. I'm going to show you guys the label real quick and then open these up. So LeBron 10. LeBron 10 XDR. Black, University Red, Metallic Silver. Opened up the box. And as you guys can see, we got some gray and black LeBron 10 paper. Your white tissue paper underneath. Here we go with the LeBron 10 Bread Away. This is one of the $180 pairs, so no textured swoosh or lace lock. Also, I believe all of the $180 LeBrons do have the logo stitched in on the tongue, as opposed to having like a uh, textured symbol placed on there. Got your XDR outdoor sole, so these can take a beating on an outdoor court for those who are going to be playing basketball. Got your LJ crown with your visible air unit, your black X. Looking at the shoe, I believe the only metallic silver on here is the outline on the swoosh. Actually, nope, your six. On your heel detail is in metallic silver. It's your black midsole, red swoosh on the tongue. You guys can see your fly wire coming up is black with red dots. Got your diamond on the front with the red poking up from the under layer as you can see. Very nice detail. So I'm really stoked on all of these LeBron 10 colorways, as you guys can tell. Hopefully we see some hot ones. That dolphin one that popped up a few days ago, definitely a must. Continuing on with today's pickups.
We got a brown Nike box and the LeBron 10 pressure pack. Gotta give a big thanks to Henry, aka King of Kicks 805, for looking out for me on that. Really appreciate that, homie. But let's get into this brown box first. So, brown Nike box. Nike Zoom Rookie PRM Premium Black Black Action Red. Now, I got back from my trip on Tuesday, and these were actually waiting at my house. Wasn't expecting them. I opened them up, saw who they were from, and I actually had to call homie because uh, I wasn't expecting these. I didn't cop another pair, but uh, he actually sent them to me out as a gift for all of the business we've done in the past. Got your Nike Remove Before Flight tag right here with your Penny logo underneath. Your Remove Before Flight tag right here. Same tag on the back, but it is your pool tab. All right, your upper. Very, very cool Galaxy print. You guys have seen it before. I do like this print more than the foam print, but hey, it's just my personal opinion. Not telling everyone what to think. Got your black or anthracite Nike swoosh outlined in silver. Glow in the dark outsole. Got your penny logo. Black pods. And like I said in the last video I had these, I do believe, in my personal opinion, the black pods look better than the glow-in-the-dark pods, but that's just me. So we got the LeBron 10 pressure pack right here. It was a special edition wooden box that released in four locations. For a better explanation on it, check out King of Kicks 805, his video on it. He went into real detail, but got your LeBron 10 box. And uh, this is what the shoes came in. The box was just an extra piece. So I have the shoes in the box. So this one is just empty now. But I'll show you guys the label. Because this is the uh, same pair that was unlabeled. LeBron 10 Plus. Black, Chrome, University Red, and Cool Gray. Before I get into the review on the shoes, I just wanted to give you guys a quick 360 of the box while I had it on a Lazy Susan. Got your Nike Plus in black. Your LJ Crown in black as well. The box is kind of like a, uh, a team red. Kind of looks a little bit orange on cam. But uh, got your LeBron 10 logo on the side. Your metal latch holding down that side. Same Nike Plus with the same LeBron logo. Already got a little ding on the box, but hey, that's how it came when they were delivered, so we can't do anything about that. The opposite latch. Now let's get into the shoes. Opened up the box. What you guys see here. You got your two very nice, high quality either microfiber or suede dust bags unbreakable lightweight explosiveness the LeBron 10 Plus with your Nike Plus logo you also have a little plastic uh, drawer where you would put your Nike Plus technology so here we go with the LeBron 10 pressures this is my second pair of them to get into the main differences between these and the non Nike Plus technology pairs like I said, the textured swoosh, the lace lock, and your LJ logo on the tongue. You got the same diamond texture, but on your $180 pairs, it is stitched in. It's your clear icy sole, your LJ crown logo in red from the uh, air unit above, Nike Plus technology symbol. Your midsole, it's kind of looking orange on cam, but it is like a team red with a solar red speckling. Really liking the touches on these LeBron 10s. 
Got your red Nike swoosh. You see the little flywire designs right there. Your dynamic flywire coming up is red with your red and black laces. So hopefully everyone was able to scoop these if you wanted them. Also got your silver six, the little speckling around it. Very nice. Once again, thank you to Henry, King of Kicks 805. Final two pairs today. These are definitely my favorite two of the video. They are the same colorway. One's from my friend in London and one is from my friend in Asia. Gotta say thanks guys, I appreciate you looking out. Let's go ahead and get into them. Air Foam Posit 1, Pearlized Pink, Metallic Silver, Black and White. Air Foam Posit 1, Pearlized Pink, Metallic Silver, Black and White. So these are two pairs of the new Pink Foam Posit 1s. Honestly, I don't know why they released these in November and not uh, October. I believe they released in Asia on October 6th, but uh, won't be dropping over here until November 21st. So you got your all pearlized pink foam posit upper. Real nice sheen on this color. Your pink foam posit logo. Excuse me, your pink penny logo. Got the icy sole on the bottom. Pink and white half cent logo right there. Your insole is a pink swoosh with a pink Nike Air. Metallic silver lines on your tongue and heel tab. Metallic silver line going up the tongue to a pink penny logo right here. I will be rocking these throughout the year, but these will definitely be in my daily rotation during the month of October. So hopefully everyone who wants these are able to scoop them up. I believe the retail will be 220 As you guys take a look at the upstairs sneaker room, I want to give a few shout outs. My size 13 homies, Mr. Fomer Simpson and Suicidal One. My three dudes always looking out. King of Kicks 805, Elite Kicks FF Lane, and Drawing Skills. I also want to mention a new channel. My friend PRP Kid One, Trey, he and I have done some business in the past. He made a new channel called Soul Land Reviews. Everyone who's been questioning Soul Land's authenticity, the shoes are legit. Check out his channel for uh, high def reviews on early releases and exclusive pairs. When the sun is down, not turn the rainbow, so in the air, so.